Somebody asked the other day about how you would deal with a brewmate wine tumbler. And the brewmate tumblers have kind of squared surfaces. Uh, they're radiused on the end. Best I can tell, that's about a 0.22 radius, uh, although I'm not sure. But then the middles kind of bulge out a little bit. And I played around with making spacers like this, but I'm not real good at node editing. And I found that when you squeezed this uh, foam board spacer on, it kind of messed with the roundness of the outer circle. So believe it or not, the best thing to do, I found, was to use acrylic. And I put uh, 82 millimeters inside diameter, 95 outside. And it's a real snug fit across the top of this rim. And then on the back side, I used 80 millimeters inside diameter, 95 outside. And it provides for a pretty even surface. I think I would engrave it in uh, this direction, you know, uh, with the top of the cup going this way. And I would make use of the end stop back here. Uh, now let's give it a roll see what it looks like you can see the flats come into play especially right in through here and there's a bit of a drop off right here i think that could be overcome with some higher power i'm probably not at a good focus distance here i'm just a little bit too close right here i would want to raise this up just a little bit but at any rate the spin is not too bad here it looks to me like you could burn from, you know, right at the edge of the paint and get a good burn probably uh, down here, a couple of inches maybe, and maybe even just a little bit further if you crank the power up. Obviously, the company did it. They're way down to here. So, uh, but they probably have 3D printed or something. They probably slap uh, these cups in a perfect fitting mold or something when they go to spin them but at any rate it's doable with a couple of acrylic rings 82 inside 95 outside 80 inside 95 outside that's what i use you could play around i think somebody that could draw nodes perfectly could probably improve on what i tried to do here but uh i think this is how you would do a brewmate rocks wine tumbler